What's good, peeps? Welcome back to the channel. Well, it's the first video of the week, so let's take care of the giveaway info real quick. The winner of last week's giveaway is Natalie Jade. Congrats, Natalie. Get in touch with me via social media or the email listed on the about page of the channel so I can get you your prize. This week's giveaway is a Doctor Strange Spider-Man No Way Home Funko Pop. All you have to do to be entered to win is be a subscriber to the channel and leave a comment on the video. It's that simple. With vampires coming to the MCU very soon, I think it's a good time to find out who is Victor Strange. Victor Strange is the younger brother of the Sorcerer Supreme, Doctor Strange. He grew up on the family farm in Nebraska. When his older brother left home to go study medicine and pretty much cut off contact with the family, Victor became very bitter with him. When their father passed away and Big Brother didn't show up for the funeral, Victor headed to New York to confront him. He found Stephen and told him how he felt and stormed off. He was so upset that he didn't look before stepping into the street. He was hit by a car and killed. Stephen had chased after him, but all he could do was pronounce him dead. Out of guilt and hope that one day technology would advance to the point he could bring his brother back, he had Victor frozen and stored in a warehouse which he owned. Shortly after, Stephen had his accident that set him on his path to become the Sorcerer Supreme. As a novice sorcerer, he attempted to resurrect his brother Victor using spells from the Book of Ashanti. He accidentally used vampiric verses and transformed Victor into a vampire. When Stephen had to fake his own death, his executor had power to the warehouse cut off unaware of Victor being stored there. Victor awoke with temporary amnesia. Victor, as a vampire, has superhuman strength, speed, reflexes, durability, and a healing factor. He could fly as well as turn into a bat. He had to drink blood to sustain himself and was vulnerable to a stake through the heart and sunlight. Marie Laveau was searching for vampires because she needed their blood to keep her youth. Using her voodoo magic, she summoned Victor to her. She wanted him to feed on Morbius, who she was holding hostage and had no use for since he was not a true undead. Victor refused to do it and escaped. Shortly after, she took control of Victor again and had him steal the Darkhold from his brother. Marie gave Victor the name Baron Blood, and the two went to Haiti. Doctor Strange and his companions traveled to Haiti to defeat Marie Laveau and rescue Victor. Marie was able to escape, but Victor was freed. Although freed, Victor still had animosity towards his brother for turning him into a vampire. Even with that animosity, he still helped them battle Dragonus and Lord Varney. Victor then moved in with Morgana Blessing and the two became romantically involved. Victor decided to become a crime fighter and would drain violent criminals of their blood in Central Park. When his brother showed him that his victims had been turning into the undead, Victor hunted them down and destroyed them. Because of his continuous hunting of criminals, his relationship with Morgana fell apart. When Doctor Strange showed Victor his latest victim was a mistaken identity, Victor staked himself through the heart to ensure he would never kill an innocent person. So what do you think about Victor Strange? Do you think we'll see him in the MCU at some point? Let me know what you think down below in the comments. As always, I appreciate you taking the time out of your busy day to stop by the channel and check out my videos. Please like, share, and subscribe. We'll see you again real soon. I'm out. Peace.